Bristol player. Harris Scott shot no good. Riley with the rebound. Essex is right there to try to pressure. Riley will pull up for the shot. Nothing but it has to feel good. So Essex in this contest playing with two fouls. They are happy to have her back out. Nice pass mm -hmm. to Danielle Shkley pushing the ball ahead to Nautica Cotero. And again, one of the hallmarks of this Rochester team, they do a really good job working the ball around and Nautica. Down the floor, into the post. Good way to start to Scalisi. Look at the defense by Armani Lomax. Down it. Britain against two. Not today. And again, off to the races is Alondra Bandy. And wow. she banks it in. Team will be playing in the 6 o'clock game, as we've been talking about. They have the big post presence. Whiteman for three. To perfection to get the ball on the post and score right off of it. So they work the ball around to try to get the open shot. And Mia Brennan is... Can the Pioneers stretch this lead out once again? They're going with what's working, and LeBeau just does not like that to Brooke Heggie. Hard to it do. It is a tall order, no pun intended. I see what you did there. And that's a... This is going to be a long day for UConn Avery Point if they are in foul trouble. Heggie lanes giving the Caymans a taste of their own medicine. Straight on three for Wogan. A little too strong, but touch. clock. You have to love the fact that it seemed like every player on the hostess team touched it. Blakeney runs over Cruiser, and this is a big call. If you get to the end of the game, and you're like, how exactly did they pull that off? Cox for three, and she bangs it down, and there's some of them. Chip Apple. This team from the Big Apple ate the whole darn thing.